Wait. How? What the? All right, so he banned my Rotos, which was a, um, you know, a good choice. His Armand is going pretty fast as well. So let's go ahead and boost turn meter. Going to give it to Georgia here. Our options are to get rid of Ancora, but I'm not too certain if we can get rid of her. Uh, I don't want to let this rat take a turn, so we're just going to do that. Hit him. Now, if she revives Armand's, then we might be in trouble. I, I don't really know what her skill set is because I don't have Encore. I chose not to do the fusion. I'm totally fine without it. I've seen her work with King Narcissus. I had to ban King Narcissus. So it looks like she revives, gives a little bit of turn meter. We're going to have to make sure that Armand's doesn't take a turn. Probably already there to try to lock him out, but I'm pretty sure we're going to be able to outspeed him, put that down on him, put him to sleep. We're going to see. She might hit hard enough with her A1, but if she puts that, that, um, counterattack up with the thing we might be fine let's try to push turn meter back for her stop her from doing anything let's boost turn meter and let's get rid of i'm pretty sure that we're going to be able to knock out armand's fairly easy let's get rid of you because you're about to take a turn and you could smite me pretty hard and we're gonna get rid of these two guys there and somebody call gordon ramsay because i just fucking cooked bro honestly warfish is just a fucking sick name so what the fuck is that guy? What the fuck was that? Wait. How? What the fuck was that? This guy's from uh, that uh, what do you call it? The uh, the I paid to get into a club thing, Supreme Club. There you go. Holy shit! What the fuck happened? Can somebody explain what happened? Because this guy took a turn before any of my guys took a turn, and these three are really are going really fast. So how did he? How did he take a turn? I'm banning him next time. Ah, fuck. It's this guy again. All right. So he he chose um, that Teox dude last time. Um, we're going to start with Armand's because that was one of his first picks. So I don't know what his new plan is going to be. So he's bringing that in. And we're going to bring in... Actually, let's bring Sifi Rotos in. And then we're going to bring in Ethwi in. Aha, Harima and UDK. Okay. Let's get rid of... So I'm not going to worry too much about UDK. And Harima might be the biggest issue here. So we're probably going to have to get rid of Harima. If Anithwi can take a turn, then we might be we might be good. We might be good enough to, to block the revive and not have to worry about him potentially being a damage dealer. Okay, now we're definitely getting rid of Harima because he brought in Makage. And of course, he's going to ban Armands. So... We'll see if we can get a little bit of redemption in. We got to give it to uh, Sifia first. If if she can outspeed um, Arbiter, looks like we can. And maybe we can give it to Anithwe. And then hit the A3 on Wukong. Now we don't have to worry about uh, dealing too much or anybody dealing too much damage. You know, so it's always like the weirdest um, kind of like weird situation. It's like when you, when you beat somebody and then you fight them again later on and they beat you it's always like the weirdest feeling for me because like I, I feel kind of kind of mad about it like oh damn or i guess it's the other way around too you know what i feel like i just said a whole lot of nothing i'm not sure what i said the point is it would be awkward if i won this so now this is just a matter of uh waiting waiting for a udk's stone skin to fall off uh, we don't really have to worry too much, I think, from here, unless Makage is able to, um, what do you call it, keep us, keep us CC'd the entire time. So, we'll see. Okay, so we're able to smash through, and we weak hit against Makage. Rotos uh, AI should have gone for uh, Arbiter there, but I guess not. So, A2? Ah, good choice. Okay, now we're gonna almost but not quite we did not have the speed boost there let's see what they do okay let me take it off of auto here because it doesn't seem like it's it's doing me too well I'm, I'm i'm too uh wasn't uh wasn't the right proper moment moment to uh to go straight into auto there so we're gonna bring anith we back full turn meter love that with the increased attack coming from siffy we're gonna hit the A1. Oh, never mind. I thought the uh, A2 was also out, but let's go hit Makage. 
and let's swipe so yeah you know redemption story thank you for not choosing that same team that you chose last time warfish i really appreciate it because it would have been sad if i lost again the other thing that i've done before is i've gone up against the same person over and over again sometimes and i will choose different champions just to half of it is just to try to screw with them the other half is to see if i if i just got lucky or if i can still beat them with pure skill or like a different team setup you know what i mean so like if my if my first team that i won with was uh Sifi rotos and you know the usual combination that you guys are seeing right now i'd probably change it up like uh, the other day i went up against somebody and i was just like all right let's just do epics only so i went in with epics only and i got my fucking cheeks clapped we have um this myth mythical champion here um I, I don't like him i think he's really annoying so it's between banning him and Armand's. but i think we're gonna bring sun wukong in this time let's just do this we're gonna do this we're banking on it we're banking on this one hopefully he doesn't ban siffy so we're gonna bang galathir i was going to bring in wukong because his a2 can actually sheep galathir and we might have had a good chance but i'm banking on outspeeding Armand's here so Siffy's gonna go first, we're gonna place the block buff, so at least for the first couple of rounds we don't have to worry too much about getting frozen. So we boost this up, and what we can do is probably, like, hit Armand's with the A2. And then we're gonna try and put Tormin to sleep. And we're just gonna hit the A1. Uh, Rodos is the next issue that we have to deal with, so we'll see. We'll see how this turns out. Is this guy a damage dealer? Wait, 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 what is he doing? What is he doing? What the fuck is that? What the shit? What the shit is that? Holy moly. Good call, good call. Stone skin Rotos. Holy moly, he just like completely gangbanged me. I wasn't ready. Let's boost. Make us make make us go faster. And it looks like we're moving too fast to the point where it kind of screws us over. So that taunt ability is really fucking me up. Place the block skills. We're gonna bring back. Um hmm. Who should we bring back? Let's bring back Anithwe. If we can get that uh, three hitter on, we might be able to do some good work. Let's just hit the A3 and see where that takes us. And that did not take us too far. Okay. This guy looks like that dude from um, God of War, Ragnarok. Kratos beat him up. And there it is. Damn. I honestly feel like I just have to have mythicals. If I want to succeed even more, or if I want to do better in Live Arena, just get Mythicals. That's what I have to do. I have to spend money to get Mythicals to be able to compete. Honestly, Hades Hemlock is a really sick name. I like that name. All right, so uh, Makagi is going to go first, but what we're going to do is start out by using Rodos. So what we're going to uh, do here is try to take Makagi out. Hopefully we don't weak hit, and then we're going to start cho uh, charging up Rodos. We do have to worry about Wukong here, um, doing his thing, stripping buffs, hitting hard, but I do believe Harima is able to uh, hit hard enough. He's going to revive. That's the best thing he can do. And then we're going to not... He's not going to do it. Okay. So we're going to boost our speed and turn meter. Going to knock Wukong out of the way just to ensure that he can't um, uh, take any turns. Never mind. We don't hit hard enough, so that might present an issue unless we put him to sleep. So because he's asleep, he can't do anything. He's about to take a turn. He's going to revive everybody. In that case, we're going to have to use Rodos. And Rodos is going to burst. Oh, never mind. Sippy, Sippy lapped Rodos. So let's go ahead and take care of Pythion, Pythion. I've heard it said so many different ways. We're going to get rid of the rabbit. Going to give Makage, or not Makage. Um, he's going to leave. Never mind. There goes that plan. All right. We're um, kind of in a tough situation here. Karima is going to be one of the bigger issues for me to deal with, and I don't have Georgia this time. I was banking on him banning one of these guys, but he did not ban them, so 
um, kind of screwed there, but let's just hope for the best and expect the worst. A3. Probably the A2. Karyon will probably hit the A2 on one of the weaker guys here. Then clap. Win some, lose some. That's okay. I'm going to save you. Oh, never mind. He beat me, so... Good job. Yeah, sometimes you just make mistakes. Um, usually usually in the drafting process, which is where I made my mistake. Um, well, what was my mistake? Uh, not properly countering his, uh, his choices there. So, what I could have done was just basically choose Armand so that he had to pick one of them, but I got too set in my ways. I saw Odin, I saw Warlord, I could have expected that he was going to go fast. Wixwill? As an avatar? Where did he get that? Bowie. Makage and that other mythical. Let's just stick with this. I don't even know who this guy is or what he does. We're going to have to ban Armands. Can't let him take that turn. Hmm. But if he's really strong, I don't, he, he has he has Soul Reap on him, so I can expect that he's going to be a damage dealer. So let's get rid of him. And let's just hope we outspeed. Because if we can go first, then we might have a good chance of uh, winning here. So we'll see. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what that mythical champion is or does. I've seen him a few times. I've fought against him a few times, but I never pay attention enough because he usually just cheeks my claps. So let's use Georgid. Let's get rid of our mons. And then we're going to hit the A2. Georgid away! Yeah.